A woman is shaken up tonight after two masked men break into her home. And now police are actually searching for those men. They're considering them armed and dangerous. On your side, Chris Oswald is live with what happened. Donna Michelle, it was around 8.30 this morning, just down this private lane where the break-in happened. And tonight, people who live at this South Nampa complex are on edge. Oh, my God, are you serious? Shock and fear spread through this Nampa neighborhood just as quick as the news that an elderly woman was the victim of a home invasion early Tuesday morning. It's scary, especially having kids. Neighbors like Joe Benavidez worry it could happen again and possibly to him. And to do something to that poor lady, you know, and then having kids, it's really scary. Nampa Police Sergeant Joe Ramirez says it was around 8.30 when the two masked men carrying weapons burst into the home of the elderly woman. The victim's quick reaction scared the would-be robbers off. It's something that she activated on her phone that has an audible alarm throughout the, her residence, and uh, this was enough to scare them off. Police say the victim was likely a random victim, something that's concerning to Benavidez, who claims the two suspects may have been trying to get into his home. 8.30, see, and this morning I was laying down, my wife went to work, and I heard some noises. And I thought it was out here. Mm -hmm. And so I came down and I looked out my back door, but there was nothing there. But it sounded like something was like, like trying to open a door. Nampa police say the threat is real and they're encouraging everyone to lock their doors and to stay alert. Anytime we're uh, uh, dealing with somebody who has the nerve to go into somebody's house, at this point we believe they're strangers and uh, commit this type of crime is a threat to the public until we can uh, uh, find out who they are. Be more aware of what we do. Start making sure the doors are locked. Uh, making sure we leave lights on at night. Now, the victim of that home invasion was not injured. Both the men were last seen driving a white or gray pickup truck. As I've said, they are both considered armed and dangerous. Anyone with information is asked to call police. Reporting in South Nampa, Chris Oswald, Today 6 on your side.